Graham, first of all, big win at the end of an emotional day. How are you feeling after that? Yeah, uh, well, relieved, um, emotional, proud of the, the players, proud of the club, because I thought they w conducted ourselves in a, in a really good way today, uh, especially with the tribute to Gianluca and then the way the crowd sort of understood the, the way the team was at. They, they, they kept supporting the players, um, you know, young players on the pitch and um, they really helped us. So fantastic day for the for the for the team and, and one to be proud of. Um, like I said, we'll have bigger moments and bigger days. But uh, in the context of where we've been at, I think it's a, it's a positive day for us. With that in mind, it felt like it was a day for leadership on the pitch. Did you get that today? Yeah, absolutely, and a lot's been made of that. And I think the boys have, have, have been trying their best. They're, they've been suffering along with us all. Um, but I think, you know, from Kepa to Thiago to Georgie, you know, they, they're all sort of helping and doing the best. And um, and combined with that with some young players that are making the debuts, like I said, I thought the crowd um, helped them along and dealt with them really, really well. You mentioned young players, you mentioned the debut, obviously Benoit coming on for his first appearance today. I mean, having Thiago alongside him would have helped, but how pleased were you with him today? Yeah, really, really pleased. I'm obviously it's his debut, so you never, you hope it's going to go well, of course, but, you know, we haven't had a massive amount of... Uh, training time together in terms of big spaces and big areas but he's looked really good in training um, Koulibaly has played such a lot of football and coming back from the World Cup we felt that it was a too close a turn around to ask him to go again so it was the right opportunity for, for Benoit in the game and I thought he uh, you can see his quality he passes the ball really well and when we needed to head it out he, he headed them out Word on Conor Gallagher he looked like he was everywhere today very dynamic breaking lines once again yeah it was I thought he was fantastic um, great energy great quality Obviously playing against a team that he that he respects and, and likes a lot, but still um, he's been frustrated because of the game time that he would like. But at the same time, he's worked unbelievably professionally and hard, always trying to support the team. So again, nice today that he gets that reward and, and is part of a winning performance. We got to see Mikhailo Mudrik at half time as well. How excited are you by him and what he'll bring to this group? Very, yeah. I mean, he's an exciting player, um, very talented player, young player with with lots to learn, but still affects the game at the highest level. Great pace, one v one, direct. I think the supporters here will really like him. And finally, Graham, what does a performance and, and a victory like this do for the mood going forward? Well, I think we all needed it. You know, it's been a tough period of time. We, we felt a little bit um, the world was going against us uh, after Fulham because we thought we played well enough to get something from the game, but the red card affects things. It, it becomes a tough, tough couple of days where you have to, you know, you have to dig in and show your quality, show your character. The, the boys have done that, and um, to get a win, to get a, a, a tight win as well. We'd like to, to, to win by more, but again, the context we're in, uh, we, we take it and we get uh, pleased with a, with a clean sheet and, and pleased with the three points. Connor, first of all, well played. How big a win was that today? It was a massive win. Um, I think the most important thing today was the three points. Um, of course, we always want to play well, and we did, especially in the first half. Um, I think naturally the second half was going to go that way and we're going to have more pressure on us. Um, but I feel I feel like we dealt with it um, brilliantly. We defended, defended great. Um, but of course, we want to we want to dominate games like that throughout the whole ninety minutes. Um, but I think it went how expected in the second half. But like I said, the most important thing was the three points. You seem to be everywhere today. How pleased were you with your performance? Yeah, I was pleased. Um, I just wanted to help the team as much as I could to to win the game, and that's what I said to myself. I was going to try and be as busy as, as possible and as effective as I can be and um, I felt like I, I'd done that and and all the other lads were, were great, um, especially the, the boys um, at, at the back. Um, so yeah, it was, it was a, a good performance and a, a great result. With recent performances and, and results in mind, it felt like today was all about personality and leadership. Yeah. Did you get that impression? Yeah, exactly and that's, that's what I, I meant when what I said earlier that um, the second half was kind of going to be going to be like how it was and we're going to have pressure on us and um, but I thought the first half was great we had played some great football we made quite a lot of chances we should have scored a couple um, so there's a lot of positives to, to build on. It was always going to be an emotional day with the Viali tributes pre-match as well I mean how did that affect things going into to a game like this? I, I thought it was amazing like just lining up I didn't realise all the guys were going to come on the pitch before the game and I was Looking at them, I was you know I looked at JT and and Jody who was my my coach in, in the academy and I had a little like smile to him and which was nice and then the video as well I was I was actually almost in tears like 
and um, obviously I, I didn't know him, but he's you know he's a, a massive legend at the club, and I think the video and everything, everything Chelsea done um, to tribute him was was amazing. Very well said. I mean, finally, Connor, with this performance in mind, what will this do for the mood, for confidence moving forward? Um, well, we we understand the task, and we're Chelsea Football Club, and we need to consistently be performing well and winning games. Of course, we're not going to win every game, but um, we, we've gone through a bad patch, and hopefully, this can be the turning point. And you know, the coach and 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 all the other coaches are going to do everything they can to help us, and and so are, are we. So are we players.